What's going on people? We over here at the Henderson household. Uh, this is the first stop in the Garage Gym World Tour. Uh, me and Shetty Shed, we're about to knock out some back this morning. Um, before we do that though, I'm gonna kind of show you guys around the spot in the garage um, so you kind of see what we're working with. So let's check out some of this gear. So we'll start out over here. Shed's got like a little iron bear set up over here. Some CMBs, some kettlebells. Uh, and then we got the rack right here. And then over here, he's posted on the GHD. Then we got this Aerodyne right here. Or it's actually a Schwinn. My bad, it's a Schwinn. And then we got the lap pull low row over here. So now we about to work. All right, so we're gonna abide basically by one rule today. Um, we're gonna alternate picking exercises. We're gonna decide that by good old fashioned Rochambeau. Um, but since we are at Shed's humble abode, I will allow him to pick the first exercise without battling in Rochambeau. So what are we popping it off with, bro? Let's ride. So we just finished up kind of working through some of the field sets just to kind of get warmed up, kind of start pushing that blood into the lats. Um, so now um, Shed's got us doing four sets of 12 wide grip lat pull downs. Um, just a couple things that we're kind of keying right here is thumbless grip. Uh, don't want our forearms, biceps taking over the movement. And then also initiating that drive by thinking about driving my elbows back. And that's how we're gonna initiate that pull. But let's get to this work. So for this last set right here on wide grip lat pull downs, uh, we're gonna have the bench right behind shed right here, just to give them an environmental constraint. So we're gonna take all the momentum, all the sway out of it so that the pull is as linear as possible and we're not recruiting anything but our lats. Yep, big squeeze down, let's go. Big squeeze down, come on, nice, come on. Nice. Nice. All right, so we just wrapped up wide grip lat pull downs on four sets, 12 reps. Uh, last set, we put the bench in for environmental constraint just to really concentrate on the lats. So now we're going to go rock, paper, scissors to see who's got the next movement. Uh, best two out of three is always rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Got no rules. Watch the boy get this dub. Ah, okay. All right, let's go. Game time. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> All right, so you guys just saw me catch that dub and rock, paper, scissors. Get used to that, because you know your boy's got the Rochambeau skill. Um, so now we're gonna move on to, um, this is basically like a high row. Uh, we got two single handles clipped to the top pulley of the lap pull down, and we're really gonna be focusing on pulling that right below our chin, and then it's almost like a mini shrug as well, and just really squeezing that upper back. So as he's pulling, he's also shrugging slightly, ever so slightly as it comes back, just to really polish off that top part of the traps. 
and then get that mad squeeze right here. Nice, good. Good, let's go. Big pull. All right, so that wraps up kind of the high row that we were doing right there with the two single handles. We end up going four sets, uh, 15 reps per set. Um, it's a movement that not really trying to pack on a whole lot of weight, but just trying to cue the proper muscle groups and just the proper path of travel for the handles um, to really target those smaller muscles across the upper back and just really polish that off. Um, so it was Shed's first time doing that movement, man, so I'm kind of going to let him tell you guys kind of like what he felt. Um, while he was getting it and kind of as he was getting in a better better groove with the movement so first of all a lot of bodybuilding as you can tell but that movement right there lit up my upper back trap rhomboid scap just lit it up in a different way that i've ever felt uh, i would dare say that uh, well versed with the lap pull machine but utilizing, utilizing it in this fashion was different that was a good difference so hey let's go so for now, we're getting ready to move on to the next movement. Um, before we do that, we gotta decide who's gonna pick. Um, so I'm ready to go ahead and body this man again in Rochambeau. So uh, let's get it, dude. That was embarrassing. All right, so unfortunately, man, y'all saw me get swept right there in uh, Rochambeau. Um, Really what happened was, it Shed's house, I won game one. So I really wasn't trying to sweep him. So regardless of my poor performance on Rochambeau, uh, we are gonna move on to some chest quarter rows with the CMBs and bands. Um, Shed decided that we were gonna go four sets, 12 reps a pop. Um, also, hooked your boy up in the middle of the workout, one of these joints, so we're gonna smash this as well. But. Uh, yeah, let's get to these rows, and um, I'll see y'all next time for Rochambeau. And your boy won't let you down again. So we just finished up with chest quarter rows right there with the CMBs. Um, she had a great idea. We ended up adding some band tension in there. Um, so now, you know what time it is. It's game time again. Your boy ain't gonna let you down this time. We got Rochambeau to figure out who's gonna call this next movement. So, let's do this. Let's go! Get your brooms out, folks. We sweeping. <laughs> All right, so your boy caught that dove, um, so I got to call the next movement. Um, and that's 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 the look right there of a man who was catching many L's, many L's, capital L's. But anyway, we're gonna move on. We're gonna go reverse grip, lap pull downs. We're gonna go reverse lap pull downs, uh, three sets of ten, and um, yeah, let's get this work. All right, so we just wrapped up um, reverse grip lap pull downs. We ended up going three sets right there, 10 reps per set. Um, we, used the, we used the easy bar attachment, and what we did was put our index finger and that little indention right on the end right there, and then just focusing on a big squeeze down. I'm trying not to use much momentum, but a little bit wasn't hurting towards the end of the set. But uh, now 
it's back game time again. Um, your boy's about to go zero dark 30. Mama mentality. Go ahead and close out this series. So, here we go. All right, that's fine. That's fine, you know. We'll take it back to my home court and close it out for real, for real. But, um, man, I'm sorry, guys. All right, so I gifted Shedrick another win in Rochambeau out of the kindness of my heart. Um, but he did repay that with um, going ahead and saying that we're gonna cap this session off with arms. So we're supersetting uh, rope press downs on the lap pool with curls over here um, we're going 12 and 12 and this bar is really really cool it's like a fat grip easy curl bar that he got from Sornex back in the day um, so we're gonna go ahead and cap this session off man um, just again guys man I'm sorry that I, I let you guys down but you know it's just me trying to be a good friend um, in my friend's house so you know the things you do for those you care about so yeah Alright guys, so we just wrapped up rope press downs and curls on the fat bar, but it's still the easy curl bar just with a fat grip. Um, Shed got that joint back from uh, Sorenex back in the day. Um, that pretty much wraps up the session, man. Just to run you guys back through it, we started off with uh, wide grip lap pull downs. Then we worked into a double single handle high row. Um, then we worked into the chest supported rows with the CMBs and then we added a little bit of band tension um, that Shed wanted to do. Um, worked out great. Um, then we came back with reverse grip lap pull downs using the easy bar attachment. And then we finished up with that super set of rope press downs and uh, fat bar easy curls. Um, solid session, man. Had to get my guy a couple dubs in the Rochambeau. Um, just, you know, chivalry's not dead. Gotta look out for it, for your people when you can. But um, man, appreciate you, my guy. And uh, yeah, we about to smash these shakes and we'll be out. So before I head out, man, again, Big shout out to my guy Chef for having me over. Um, first episode of the Garage Gym World Tour. Um, popped it off, man. No better way, man. Uh, one of my best friends. So, we're gonna cap this thing off with the best post-workout shake known to man. Um, that potion, if you ain't on it yet, get your mind right, get your body right, make good decisions. Until next time, man, I'm out. Oh.